Carson Wentz needs to go to the Indianapolis Colts. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. Today on Sporting Mentality, you might know me as RelayTS on TikTok. Well, today I'm going to be talking about Carson Wentz because I'm a Colts fan and his recommended spot, his, his, his spot that he wants to go to are the Colts. So the Colts right now, are in the playoffs, but they have Philip Rivers as the, as the quarterback. They play. They paid Philip Rivers twenty five million dollars for one year. Philip Rivers. That was probably the worst signing in Colts history, just in my opinion. He didn't do too bad. Uh, was he worth twenty five million? No, not my not my opinion. Um, it was kind of just like a a useless signing. Like it, it it's not doing much for the Indianapolis Colts this year. Yeah, they're gonna get to the playoffs. Are they gonna win the Super Bowl? Probably not. Um, but this is why I want Carson Wentz to come to the Colts. So let's look at his stats real quick. His stats obviously are not good at all this year. 2,600 yards, 16 touchdowns, and 15 interceptions. Now let's compare that with Phillip Rivers. Well, Phillip Rivers is also 39 years of age. So Phillip Rivers next year is going to be 40 years old at the end of the season. Is he going to retire? I would say probably considering he has to get foot surgery on his old ass foot. So his stats this year are actually really good. 4,200 yards, 24 touchdowns, 11 interceptions. Um, 68 completion percentage. Now let's compare these stats real quick. Uh, so if we, uh, how do we do this? So we got 2,600 yards versus 4,600 yards. Granted, that doesn't really count because of the, uh, you know, he didn't play as many games. But let's just talk about the other stats. So we got 57% completion percentage. Phil Rivers has 68% completion percentage. Now let's look at the let's look at the wide receivers. Wide receiver wise, they both don't really have any options. I mean, um, Rivers has a washed up Ty. Um, you know, a good Michael Pittman, Zach Pascal, um, but. Carson Wentz has Jalen Rager, uh, Alshon Jeffrey he hasn't been healthy for like 15 years. Um, Zach Ertz, which is good. Their, their tight ends are amazing. And uh, Darren Schultz, I don't know his first name, but Schultz. So they have good tight ends. The wide receivers are subpar. But yeah, I mean, Phillip Rivers was good this year. I just think he's going to retire, especially if they make if they make it pretty far in the playoffs and on a good year. He's never even made, you know, that far in the playoffs. So making the playoffs is already a good year for Phillip Rivers. Um He's had a good year this year. I would say almost a fantastic year uh, for him at least. Um, but like his stats look amazing. But when you watch him play, it's not fun to watch Phil Rivers play in my opinion. He's such a boring quarterback. He can't run out of the pocket. He throws like a peewee uh, t-ball player. He, th he throws like I did when I saw uh, that one guy in the Indians throwing sidearm. So I wanted to impersonate him. Like that's how Phil Rivers throws. He throws like I did in t-ball. Um, he's not an exciting quarterback to play. I don't think, like, he, he's only going to get worse. He has to have surgery. He's going to be even slower than he already is. He's already the slowest person in the NFL. Um, and this is why I want Carson Wentz. Back to the Carson Wentz conversation. All right, let's look at Carson Wentz stats real quick because I just deleted it for some stupid reason. Carson Wentz. He's been in the league for four years. Um, was he an MVP? I don't think he was, right? He was, like, a, in the MVP running, right? I don't think he was ever an MVP. Okay, yeah, he was never an MVP. He was an MVP candidate, which he was He was amazing. He was honestly amazing. 4,000 yards, 27 touchdowns, 7 interceptions. I mean, look at those stats. That is insanely amazing. Um, and he, he looked like an MVP quarterback, too. He had some injuries. He, injuries? Oh, my God. He's had some injuries, uh, back injuries, you know, the classic quarterback injuries. Um, he reminds me of Andrew Luck, just not as good, okay? this That's why I want him. Because if I was Carson Wentz right now, I'm sure retirement is in the back of his mind, but I'm sure he doesn't want to retire, especially on this note, because he was so good when he came into the NFL. So if I'm Carson Wentz right now, I'm thinking, let's go to the Colts. Let's revive my career. Good offensive line. They're going to probably draft a wide receiver first or second round since I'm coming there, uh, if I do go there. So if that's the case, I'm going to have a good offensive line. I'm going to have good young wide receivers. I'll have C.Y. Hilton still. And... You know, I'll be protected for the first time in my career, arguably, except his MVP year, which he had a good offensive line in 2019, but his offensive line got injured this year. That's why he was absolutely terrible, didn't have any time to do anything. And this year, I think he was honestly just, like, mentally drained because his decision-making was very subpar. Like, I think I could have made better decisions than Carson Wentz out there. And that's, you know, coming from me, who doesn't even know how to throw a football, you know, that well. So, his, second, his sophomore year, I mean, 33 touchdowns and 7 interceptions, are you kidding me? That is insane. That's when he had Deshaun Jackson, though. Uh, you know, MV, uh, Super Bowl year, Nick Foles came in. He, like, he's had amazing, amazing years. Like, this year, I don't know what happened. He, he just doubled his interceptions out of nowhere, and he only played 12 games. He got benched by Jalen Hurts. Jalen Hurts, 
is obviously going to be their future quarterback. So Carson Wentz is definitely going to be out of Philadelphia. I don't know what other team he'd go to besides the Indianapolis Colts. It just it just makes sense because he's like he's like so. As Colts fans, we've always wanted Andrew Luck to come back from retirement because you know we have a good offensive line now. So think about it as if we're getting a worse Andrew Luck who's coming back from retirement and is three years younger. He's twenty eight years old. Um, he's ha- he's had injuries. He's he was bad as last year, but he was amazing before that, and he has so much potential. So Carson Wentz coming to the Colts, good offensive line, good wide receivers. I think they are unbiasedly a Super Bowl contender, and I don't think that's far fetched at all. Right now, they're already uh, you know a good playoff team, have one of the best defenses in the league, arguably not even arguably they're a top three defense in the league. Uh, adding Carson Wentz to that team. If he goes back to his old self, that's un- that's undoubtedly a Super Bowl contender, especially if he gets some more wide receivers in there, whether it's from free agency or the draft. I just feel like this would be the best fit for Carson Wentz. Um, I-, I guess he could go to like a uh, 49ers if they don't want Garoppolo, or he could go to the Jaguars, um, but Minshew seems to be their guy. Um, you know, it just he could go to a lot of teams, but like. The only other Colts options are to re-sign Philip Rivers, which if they did that, I would not watch one Colts game next year because it'd just be, you know, stupid, too. Uh, they could get Matt Ryan, which would be absolutely terrible because his contract's bigger than freaking, I don't know. It's just so big. It's just so big. It's so big. It's like $45 billion. Um, they could get Matthew Stafford, which, which would be great. It would be great. Um, he'd be a guaranteed success. I, I just like taking a gamble on Wentz. Reich was his co- uh, offensive coordinator during the Super Bowl run um, when he was amazing. Um, so they have that chemistry going. You know, it's just it's just a great fit, I feel like. And I think Carson Wentz is undoubtedly coming to the Colts in the offseason. I think this is the best fit for him. Let me know what you guys think about this in the comment section below. Let me know if you want more videos like this. Just me talking about why I think this would be great. This is unbiasedly. At first, I didn't want Carson Wentz because I thought he was washed. I did some more research. I figured out, you know, his team is not – not good at all this year. Uh, his play style just doesn't fit that Eagles team anymore, and um, he definitely needs a uh, new refresh, and I feel like he'd be great in the Indianapolis Colts. So let me know what you guys think. Make sure to drop a like on the video, subscribe, turn on post notifications. I'll be coming out with more videos on this channel uh, you know, in the coming weeks, so I hope you guys enjoy it. I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.